How's it going boys? So today we are gonna get big, we're gonna get ripped, and we're gonna do it through this deck, obviously, because that that's way more easier than real life. So, this deck is extremely simple. We drop small things and those things become extremely ginormous very, very, very fast. Mostly because of branching evolution, because this card honestly makes no sense at all. And uh, Qatar's Crusade, pretty good. So, we have 4 Land of War Elves, 4 Incubation Druids, 4 Branching Evolutions, 2 Looming Boys, 4 Beast Whispers, 3 Vivian, Vivians, Arc Bow Rangers, 7.6 versions, not 7.6, Jesus Christ, 6.7, 3 Guitars Crusade, 4 Great Hinges, 4 Stone, uh, stone Coil Serpents, 4 uh, Wildwood scour Scourges, and a bunch of lands, 1 Karn's Bastion, 24 lands to be specific. And we have a sideboard for once in our life with Vivian, and it's absolutely random, don't ask me why. But it's there, it's in the description if you want to see it, it's nothing special, it's just a b bunch of random MacGuffins. So yeah, the deck is extremely simple, the deck is extremely easy to play, and it's honestly quite hard to get a bad opening hand with this. Admittedly, it's possible, you can start off with uh, four hinges, two crusades, and a land. And then you mulligan and you get four hinges, two crusades, and zero lands. Oh, magic. A competitive game at its finest. So, let's see. This is one of the worst starting hands that you can get. Okay, so we're gonna be hoping for a miracle, essentially. Because while we do have ramp, and I appreciate game that you have figured out that we want the early drops early... You have not exactly given me anything that to supplement this. Admittedly, technically, it's not exactly the hardest thing. I swear to god, this game doesn't even shuffle the deck. Sometimes I play it and I have, I have the game ends and I have only seen three of my cards and three of the enemy's cards because that's... Technically it's better, so whatever. But yeah. It, we, we have a slight problem in this game. It's called the shuffler does not work like even at all Fix it wizards But rapture spire haven't seen this in a while. Well, whatever. We're gonna see what happens Okay So what can we actually do here? Not much the music still bugged on this map And also you can't click on anything in this map except these puddles not sure why that's the case, but hey, v v v Wizard's logic, I, I will flat out just say uh, here. Okay, so the good part is, we technically have enough for a hinge, and then we have Druids. There is obviously that slight chance that he just discards this hinge magically. Wait, what? What? Why are you playing enemy con? What, 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 what are you doing? I don't know. A ram deck? Oh! Uh-oh. That means we have a pretty low chance of su uh, succeeding right here, boys. For extremely sadly obvious reasons. Unless... Nah. Okay, whatever. Onward we go. Hey. If you make it the uh, 100 plus card deck, you're gonna have problems. But if you make a 100 card deck, Trust me, the game's gonna be like, ah, oh, you poor little baby, you're here to have fun. How about you get literally everything your heart desires? That's usually how it goes. By the way, this is the second 100 plus card deck I have seen the, uh, today. And it obviously, the previous one also obviously had Chromatic Laten ready to go. Yeah, that's pretty cool, I guess. Okay, boys, we actually have MacGuffin power here. Okay, so this makes our Incubation Grandma into a Hyper Steroid Grandma and a land. Nice. Okay, any moment now we're gonna hit like really cool things and it's gonna happen. But I have a strange uh, feeling that these things are gonna go bye-bye because there's no way he has not gotten Cleansing Nova. You may think that this is pre-recorded, by the way. I know, but it's not. I literally just know 
I have played this game enough to know how the algorithm works. <laughs> you what? What? Did you honestly think it's not gonna be a cleansing, Nova? Seriously? Did you honestly think for a millisecond that's not gonna happen? Because let me tell you, it will happen. Oh god, yeah, this guy is just getting the stuff. Gets the lands. Gets the stuff, and I get a land. Fantastic. Yeah, I have no idea why magic is uh, why magic does this to a hundred plus card decks. But a hundred card decks usually extremely well played hit the uh, the curves and everything that they need. I don't know why, but ma the algorithm is literally just built for these decks. It seems like. Okay. Seriously, of all the things you could have found, you found exactly that. Wow. Yeah. You never... Man, I pro my worst win rate probably is against 100 plus card decks. That, that much I can honestly... I'm pretty sure it actually is like that. 100... Good game. Of course you have that. Of course you have that. Why, why, why would not you have that, right? Okay, wow, even better. Okay, watch me draw land. Oh, wow, it's a Vivian! Honestly, at this point in time, it could have well, could, could as well have been a land, but, you know, hey. Okay, we're gonna stop playing here because it's pointless. <laughs> oh, boys, Magic the Gathering Arena. It's a competitive game, have I mentioned? <laughs> oh, well, whatever. I honestly feel bad for these the people who think a card game like this is anything else but RNG and algorithm. I just like to sit here, play a little bit, have a little bit of fun, and see what happens. Admittedly, Standard currently is a mess, and Historic is literally just a bunch of Ulamogs currently, also, so which that that's a problem, and a bunch of Ugans. Okay, let's see, uh, Elfie boy, uh, Viled something, and, well, at least it's lands. Hello, hello there, enemy con. I don't like you, you don't like me, let's be friends. Okay, at least it's a boss avatar, that's relatively, usually simple. Okay, we're gonna see how it goes. If we're lucky, we're gonna get stuff done. We have lands, we have thingamajigs, we have boops and boops. Well, this is technically not the worst situation I have been in my life. It's like this only second worst situation. Okay, so let's drop some bait, shall we? Let's see what's enemy Kun's reaction when a wild wood scourge appears. Nothing, huh? Okay, uh, that's fine. We still have a, uh, a Scoily Boy. No, it's not a 100 plus card deck I played today against one who used the exact same thing. By the way, I'm interested. Okay, you're a burn deck, aren't you? Light up the stage, quite off. Oh, I have played against this guy! No! Absolutely not! I have played against this godforsaken dribble! He has a 4 cost, no, 3 cost Chandra, not the 3, uh, he has the teenage Chandra also in his deck, and he has b This deck can't win against the Brush Taunter. It just flat out can't. That's like the thing. Nothing I do wins against the goddamn brush taunter as sad as it is. Oh boy. If he plays it, we're done. If he if he literally just plays it, we are 100 percent donezo. Insanity. Well, currently at least we're doing something, right? AKA hitting his face without being pummeled by this thing. Well, it's gone. Okay, let's hope he maybe only had one of them, not one of them in his hand, like I kind of predict he has. Okay, that's a bunch of removal just for one, one, one uh, coily boy. Admittedly, he is a red deck purely, so, you know, it's kind of a little bit annoying. Okay, let's see how this goes now, shall we? Bam! Drop an elfie, boy. 
suddenly he becomes a little bit more, well, pleasant to look at to a degree, I don't know. Whatever, keep, 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 keep buffing. And now we can at least, well, they're pretty close to actually killing the guy. Okay, do this, pop the pop the Fable Passage. Uh, get a land, probably green. We honestly have far too much uh, white in, uh, in on the board. Okay, and now we can threaten lethal. This is payback, enemy con. This is payback! Ah, oh, yes. Finally. See, told you. Yeah, this is exactly the deck, by the way. Oh my god. I don't understand what's the point, by the way, of playing this Chandra with this. Are you just gonna hit yourself or something? Because it looks like it. Okay, anyway, let's see how far we can actually go with this. Bam. How much we can draw? A great hand. Not exactly what I wanted. But this thing is huge already. Okay, time to finish it off, boys. Not even gonna kill the Chandra. That's that's just no. I could have, but you know, whatever. Oh, payback feels so good. Plays the goddamn goblin that fights things against the deck that literally gets a twenty twenty. Sometimes when lucky on turn like four. Okay, no longer. But the first iteration of this deck could technically get out like a uh, 10 10 by turn 3 if extremely lucky. But yeah, I guess it's fine anyway. Hey, at, at, at least at least we won a game, right boys? Right? Right? That, that, ma that matters? No, it doesn't. Okay, onward we go. What kind of shenaniganry stupidry we can see this time? It's a J Salvatar. Ugh. But numbers at the end. Ugh. Okay, let's see. Coily boy, beastie boy, Vivian. Yeah, Vivian's not looking too hot at the moment. Well, she never does on one hand, so technically, it's fine. Okay, let me think about my options here. We have cards. We can play cards, at least I think. And here it is, we, we found cards. Okay, on one hand, this is as good as it gets. On the second hand, is this a life gain deck? I have not... Oh, of course it's not. Yeah, I was gonna say, I have not seen a life gain deck for a long time. Three colors, three colors of control, three colors of removal and control. Interesting. Honestly, should have popped the Fable Passage there, but hey, it's just a theory. Okay, a Looming Boy. Not exactly great, but with a Beastie Boy, it's technically not all so bad. Okay, let's take a Forest. And watch Beastie Boy be killed. Wait a minute, he had no actions? Interesting, how? Oh. I hate you. Okay! Not nice. Not nice at all. Okay, let's start pumping up the Vivian. It's on. We don't exactly have another play anyway, so technically it's fine. Okay, we can drop a crusade later onwards. Well, a bit later onwards. We're just gonna see how it goes, right? We're just we're just we're just gonna see. It's a control deck, so technically until we get the hello there. Oh, I know what you are. You're a deck. So his idea is essentially to just get this in the graveyard. Uh, and then, essentially just, uh, just get it out of the graveyard. I have done a similar thing. Okay, great, we actually found things to cast. I am, I am so amazed. Okay, so do this. It gets, it get it gets stuff on it, right? Uh, that's, that, that's amazing. Like, half, half of our life we tried this. Okay, then we do this, and suddenly everything's relatively big. This can happen faster, this can happen slower, it depends a lot. But now we need to choose the right card for the job. A.K.A. most likely, honestly, this buffoon. Because he kills stuff. Anyway, we have a chance to do something here. Maybe win, maybe lose. Yep. Dude, we have done a combo like this, like, so long ago. 
Uh, you just mirror march, get this in the graveyard, and then summon it, and that's all she literally wrote. Yeah, it, it's it's not the most elaborate combo to a degree, but it's definitely what you would call a combo. So yeah, let's just buff these things continuously. Okay. By the way, was that the smarter play or was that the stupider play? I'm pretty sure you're supposed to just buff one of them, but honestly, who cares, right? We're getting wiped, and that's pretty obvious. Okay, that, that was great, that was great. 10 out of 10. Kind of expected that, obviously. Okay, get a white land, because now it's the minority. Uh, 5, 8, at least 8, I think. Okay, at least 8, we did it. Technically, we're actually threatening a lethal, like, really, uh, really, uh, really big here. If he does not kill it, we kill him. That's honestly just the way of the dodo. But I have a feeling he's... Dude, what the hell? Okay, so he kills the Vivian. Amazing. All I need to do is get... Well, essentially... Oh, actually, this. Ha! Ya yeah, boy! Wait, 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 wait. That's illegal. Technically, it doesn't matter. Okay, watch him get the Dance of Dervishes, get Oath of Kaya back, and summon 50 Oaths of Kaya. And obviously, Magic made it that the first Mirror Match, well, at least that was previously, they made it that the first Mirror Match that you drop can never flip a heads up, so it can never generate a, co a copy. Not sure if that's the case anymore. Would not honestly be surprised. Also, questionable, why the hell did you not do this? Because it does not require... Oh, because it's Qatar's Crusade. It all makes suddenly sense now. Anyway. Did you really not draw anything? Yeah, you didn't. But yeah. Uh, copying Ka uh, Oath of Kaya with Mirror Match has, is one of my oldest decks that we did a long, long time ago. Well, now, I know, right? Unexpected, kinda, not really. But yeah, I guess onward we go anyway. Doesn't really matter too much now, does it? Okay, so. Can, can we get a game? Can we get a big boy game? Can we get a big boy game with a gay gay game? We can. It's against, uh, whatever avatar. Not good. Okay, how are we getting these, uh, I don't, I... I, under I understand magic, you think to a degree that I need the Looming Shaman because it's a two copy of, so I really, 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 really want it, but I don't, so let's mulligan once in our lives. Okay, this was not honestly the worst case scenario. Technically, still pretty bad, but whatever. Not gonna get, uh, get, not gonna get rid of all the, uh, any of the high-costing things, by the way, boys, because... Maybe you do not know this, maybe it doesn't exactly show often, but I have standards. Extremely minimalistic standards that almost anything anything can match, but I do have them. So. Oh wait, you did nothing? That's, that's, that's terrific enemy, Kun. I'm so proud of you. Why do I have a feeling you're gonna bounce it, considering you didn't counterspell it? Oh no, you're a flash deck, it all makes sense now. Or are you gonna bounce it? I hate you so much. I hate you so much. Oh, that's why I was given a looming boy, because reasons. Obviously. Obvious! I did not see the writing on the wall, boys. Are you telling me you literally have a perfect hand? I can't even get a third lane, but you have a perfect hand. That's... it's amazing. So much skill, probably. Well, skill or not, this is how you create a big druid. Boom. Okay, so now technically a great hinge is in our reach. Or you know our deck is absolutely dead because reasons, one or the other. Uh, doesn't look like enemy Kun is doing a lot. On the other hand, does anyone care? Probably not. Oh god. Oh 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 god. Okay, let's do this. Is he gonna bounce it? No? That's disgusting. Okay, how about this? 
A land of all elf. Come on, I shall counterspell this. You didn't! Okay, now I'm gonna cast this. Don't counterspell this, though. Oh, come on! It technically helps you mill me! Oh, God. Of course you would have this. Okay? I'm gonna assume that's gonna be the card that draws a lot. Oh, Ashiok! Even worse! Okay, that's great! Absolutely fantastic! You know, you know, you no longer can cast whatever the hell that card is called, by the way, and Mikon. Hope you're fucking proud. Okay, eh. Have I mentioned that this game is absolute garbage, by the way? I, f I feel I don't mention that enough! Okay, anyway. What 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 is our hi highest probability chance of actually scoring gold here? Well, it was honestly probably not attacking, huh? We can survive most likely for almost zero turns or whatever. Okay, I, I hope that this does something except kills me. W watch him, watch him get a card that draws things. Ah! Uh, oh, on summon? No, just just the milk. Okay, that, that makes absolutely perfect sense. Wow! This is why everyone hates mill, by the way. And this is why I ran get Guy's Blessing in the deck for a while. <laughs> exactly for situations like this. Exactly for situations like this. Okay, anyway, onward we go, I guess. I guess, kinda. Maybe. What the chance for that last dance? We're, we're gonna see. Okay, what splendors await us uh, uh, on the horizon, boys? God, I don't I actually want. No, I don't. I don't. I don't want to know. Why can't we play just a normal mid-range opponent deck who does not get Ulamog on turn five, who does not get Ugin on turn five, who does not get the perfect mill hand? You know. You know, can can we please get some of that action going on? Okay, this looks honestly a lot better. Wow, I'm surprised. Okay, a land of our elf, an incubation grandma, and a beastie boy. And we go first. Is this destiny? Like, where are all the life? Of course. Oh, oh, it, it, now it's just a goblin deck. Wow, I am so happy. A goblin deck, boys! Can you imagine? And I'm probably gonna draw all the lands in the world. Okay, so, my idea is, he's gonna drop the two-cost goblin that uh, creates two goblins, and then he's gonna drop the... Oh, wait, this is not a goblin deck, this is just a low-tier aggro, schmagro deck. Okay, wow, did not ex... Again, did not expect that, boys, did not expect it. Okay! So, let's not attack and create an extremely oversized stone coil boy. Ah, by the way, I really like the art on this. Well, I, not really, but, you know, the sword looks good, and it's actually a spear, obviously. What, well, what, what, what else? Well, who cares, right? Okay, do we drop a coily boy, or do we drop this? Okay, I'm gonna go for, I'm gonna go for the big ball play. Beastie boy. Okay, and now we're gonna be reasonable and drop a stony coily boy and draw two cards. <clears throat> Technically, we can't lose off of this point because we have just flat out too much of an advantage. Emphasis on, like, technically, you know? Because remember, why by the way are people using Raid Bombardment if you still have the old two cost card? It's better on every level. If you're gonna use cards like this, oh, a Doxos, no one cares. Actually, well, it's only a single Gobbo. Yeah, no one cares, enemy Kun. No one cares. Okay, yeah, still drawing lands like that is absolutely no tomorrow for extremely obvious reasons. Are you gonna Doxos me with an Ember Cleave, though? I'm gonna go on a limb here and say probably. <laughs> okay, let's see it. 
Well, yeah, you should probably attack. Okay, not gonna block. No Ember Cleave. Also, you don't have the mana for it, so that's good. And, oh god, that is not a land, boys. I repeat, that is not a land. Okay, we're gonna draw a lot here, and we're gonna draw big. Obviously. Obviously. I guess third time's the charm. Literally the worst card I can draw, but technically at least it's something, right? Obviously and obviously. God, I love this game so much. <laughs> uh, just draw me that land. Oh! Again, it's the worst pro possibility. I, I, mean, I guess we're almost out of lands, huh, game? Yeah, almost out of lands. Oh, what are you? So, what's your plan? How are you planning to give me lands when I'm almost out of lands? Oh God, he's probably thinking, uh, mio, mio dios, mios dios. Ha! Uh, this he has so much advantage. His car, his head is probably full of things that just flat. Seriously, stop! That's getting dangerous. But yeah, he's probably thinking. Oh, merdio dios. His hand is full of dangerous things. So full. So, so full. Dude, seriously? Wait, is he just planning to kill me? Oh, that's not cool. But yeah, he's obviously planning to kill me. Those things can't block, though, enemy con. I hope you understand that part. Or actually, kind of, kind of hoping you don't understand that part gives gives me kind of the advantage and shit. Uh, but yeah. Okay. Okay. Good, good. Any moment now. Gonna gonna stop drawing things. You know, it's cool. It's cool. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. By the way, seriously, where's my Tatar thingamajiggy? Okay, okay, game, please, game, well, at least it's free real estate at this point, bam, yeah, great hinges are free real estate at this point, okay, oh, finally, look what the cat goddamn dragged in, only took five centuries, but it magically did, okay, gonna attack with this, we can't lose off of this point, so it's absolutely fine, Okay, does our deck have zero lands in it? That's like the real question, honestly, at this moment in time. Okay, the Beastie Boys are exactly useless now. Okay, so boys. Watch what happens when evolution meets, meets crusades. You're gonna love it. Oh, jeez. Man, this guy is, like, probably unhappy with the, how things turned out, huh? Wait, am I dead? No, I'm not dead. Wait, are you gonna shock me? No, wait, no, you're not, are you? You're, you're not, no, you're... No, you're a nice guy, right? You're, 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 you're a reasonable person. Or red deck player. You're not gonna shock me. There's no way. No way at all are we blocking out. Yes, we are. Okay. Watch this, boys, as we are not gonna get- Oh god, we did not get shocked. I am actually totally- OH GET THE NO So close! So close! <laughs> Bad table, Kun. So close. Yet so far. At least we won the game, I guess. No satisfaction, though, has been achieved. Ah, well, that's whatever. We're gonna make a Land of Our Elves deck. And it's gonna be... Oh, that's gonna be special. Let me tell you that much uh, flat out right there, boys. <laughs> oh! Yeah, we're gonna... We, 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 we make fun of Land of Our Elves a lot here because it is literally the most... Well, non-male card in the game. And there are actual female characters in the game. Yet he still magically takes the cake. But it's gonna be... Well, at least we got the combo wombo now off. 
I can't wait to see how magically we magic uh, ma manage to lose this. But yeah, at least that's here. So, yeah. Suddenly, stone coil, stone coil serpents and whatnot are, well, a danger to society. Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay. Well, that's, 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 that's one way to buff an elfie boy. Watch. Bam. Yeah, suddenly he's a monster. I know, right? Anyway, flip the coin, see what happens. Do it! Oh, that's also good. Honestly, I'm okay with that. Yeah, flip the coin! Yeah, exactly. Now, Land of War Elf, you kill whatever the hell that is. It's an ugly card also. Okay, so, let us do this. Hey, look at this. Suddenly, magically, we, we have the combo. It's it's here, and it's staying. He's probably killing the Vivian, though, because he most likely understands what happens. Ah, uh, I wonder how can he do that? He, even I don't understand what's happening. But I guess that's completely fine under the, under these circumstances. Okay, a great hinge would be absolutely terrific now. How about it, game? How about it? Just just give me a great hinge. See what happens. Any time now. No stop with these things. <gasps> Well, I actually did ask for it. Ask and you shall receive, boys. Look at this. This makes no sense at all. Well, it actually does. It makes perfect sense. But whatever. Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Ha! Loser! Ha! Loser! Yeah, mostly because he's a furry avatar. Oops. Oops, my ass, dude. It's completely your fault for picking a 40 avatar. That's honestly the reason you're losing. Also, did I just notice a new graphics glitch in this stupid game? I think I did. So, when we hit uh, the uh, minus 3, uh, what happened? Oh, he just surrenders. Well, boys, that's the deck. Honestly, he probably had a good chance of winning me with the coin flip. Bullshit. But hey, maybe there's someone less lucky than me in this world. Oh, that poor soul. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, man, I never rely on luck. Don't ever rely on luck. Rely on skill. But said the guy who's playing Magic the Goddamn Gathering. Well, anyway, this is the deck, boys. It's pretty fun. It's pretty rad. It's pretty brad. So, you know, whatever. Anyway, this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel. Check out the check out the channel. Check out check out Discord. Check out the Patreon. Check out the everything and have a nice day. Bye bye.